hello guys so today i'm going to make a video about math it's not going to be subtraction not not addition not even division but multiplication it's pretty much the easiest one for me the second easiest and well, it's the it's the second easiest for me and that's what we're going to do today yesterday me and my classmates and my whole entire class made a google meet and our teacher made us an assignment to memorize or summarize table one and two for now and I hope I can try to recall from my ta multiplication table from table 1 to table 10. And I hope I still remember it since mom made, made me memorize it when I was in years to be 1. Now let's start table 1. Table 1. 1 times 1 equals 1. 1 times 2 equals 2. 1 times 3 equals 3. 1 times 4 equals 4. 1 times 5 equals 5. 1 times 6 equals 6. 1 times 7 equals 5 times 7. And 8 is 8, and 1 times 9 is 9, and 1 times 10 equals, of course, 10. So, guys, let's proceed with table 2. 2 times 1 equals 2, 2 times 2 equals 4, 2 times 3 equals 6, 2 times 4 equals 8, 2 times 5 equals 10, 2 times 6 equals 12, 2 times 7 equals 14, 2 times 8 equals 16, 2 times 9 equals 18, and 2 times 10, I... So easy, you just have to double the numbers. If it's the two times anything, any number you like, and like 10 from 100, it's just 100 plus 100, and that's gonna be 200. So that's what 3 times 1 equals 3, 3 times 2 equals 6, 3 times 3 equals 9, 3 times 4 equals 12, 3 times 5 equals 15, 3 times 6 equals 18. And 3 times 8 equals, you guessed it, 24. And what do you still recall? I don't know if I could still know to the higher numbers, like 4 to 10. So it's going to be difficult. And alright, uh -huh. 3 times 9 is 27. And practically, 3 times 10 equals 30. Great, let's proceed to table 4. I'm almost done with the start at the beginning. 4 times 1 equals 4, 4 times 2 equals 8, 4 times 3 equals 12, 4 times, 4 times 4 equals 16, 4 times 5 equals 20, 4 times 6 equals, 4 times 6, no, this is what I'm scared about, okay, 4 times 6, and that's, oh, right, 24, the things on my friend, 4 times 7 equals 28, and 4 times 8, oh, no, 32, Practically nine times four times nine equals thirty six, and pretty much all you guys did four times ten equals forty. Serious, guys, we're actually halfway through our multiplication table since we're already now in table five. Now, this is pretty much the easiest since you just anytime you multiply, you just by five, like five and between, you know, the whole stuff. You just have to spice skip by five. Now, let's start again. Five times one equals five, five times two equals ten, five times three equals fifteen, five times four equals twenty, five times five, twenty-five, and we have five times six is just like thirty, and five times seven equals thirty-five, five times eight equals forty, five times nine equals forty-five, and five times ten, fifty. Yeah, you're, you can have the age of fifty if you like now. Now we're in table six. We just need more and more tables and we're done with this thing. We're gonna do six times one equals six. Six times two, six times two equals twelve, and six times three equals eighteen, and six times four, um, twenty-four, and six times five is, I guess it's a table ago. It's thirty! And six times seven, um, oh wait, six times six, and that's thirty-six. It's gonna be 42 and 6 times 8. Oh my god. 6 times 8. Um, Alright, it's easy. You just have to plus it with. Yeah, you just have to plus the 42 with 6 and then that's the answer. So it's just gonna be 42. 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48. Okay, that's 48. And 6 times 9. Okay, that's gonna be 54. And 6 times 10. How could I forget? Just by 10 till 6 times, and by 10, that's 60. This is my favorite one. 
the table of seven. It's literally my age. So yeah, I'm really excited about seven. And that's just the easiest one I memorized since it's my grand age. Yeah. Seven times one, it's seven again, for all of God's sake. And seven times two, 14. Seven times three equals, it's already 21. 21, four, and the next four, the last going to be 28. So the easy seven times five, then that's thirty five. I already mentioned that. The by five table now. We're gonna have six by seven and six. Well, I guess it's forty two. And seven is forty nine. And seven times eight. That's what I'm confused about. Yes, you're just gonna have to minus sixty three because that's gonna be the nine times. Okay, just kidding now. It's really tough. It's really, really tough now. Seven times eight. Oh wait. If I multiply 49 with another 7, that's the answer. Oh, no, I forgot it was 56. And if you're, I already told you, 7 times 9 equals 60. And practically 7 times 10 equals 70. Guys, let's proceed to table 8. Two more tables and I'm done, but let's just go to 8. Now I'm going to have 8 times 1 equals 8. 8 times 2 equals 16. 8 times 3 equals 24. And 8 times 4. Well, that's 32, and 8 times 5 equals 40, 8 times 6, oh, I don't know the answer just, oh right, it's 48, and 8 times 7, I already did that, it's, it was 56, and now 8 times 9, oh right, 72, I wait, if 8 times 8, so it's going to be 64 now, here we go now, 8 times 9, so that's going to be, you guessed that I told you already, 72, and 8 times 10, oh no, that's going to be 80. Guys, we're gonna go with just triple nine. One more, and we're gonna be done. That's ten, if you don't know. Now we're gonna have nine times one, nine. Nine times two, nine times two. All right, it's gonna be eighteen. Nine times three, it's gonna be seven. Nine times nine times four, that's six. Nine times five, it's by five, and that's twenty-five. And nine times six, wait a minute, fifty-four. And nine times seven, sixty-three. Nine times eight equals well, seventy-two. And nine times is 81 and 9 times 10 is 90. Now here we go. Finally guys, we're in the last multiplication table. Table 10! Right now. Let's start. 10 times 1 is 10. 10 times 2 is 20. And 10 times 3 equals 30. And 10 times 4 equals 40. 10 times 5 equals 50. And 10 times 6 is 60. And 10 times 70 10 times 7 equals 70, and 10 times 8 equals 80, 10 times 9 is 90, and 10 times 10 is 100. Yes, we did it! I can't believe my brain could go that far in the past. Well, come on, I didn't grade 2, so it's just a year ago, but I'm still very proud of myself to actually remember it now. I'm so happy, guys, for you to actually watch my video till the end, and of course, as always, you learn something new every day. And if you really need some help with math, just go to my channel for a reason, you know? Bye-bye. I really need to learn more. Please, bye.